Hi everyone, how are you today? It is Sharon here. So we've got these silky chickens. Now they do come with a set of two transfers. These are, remember the transfers are a one-off use, whereas the stencils you can use over and over again. So these are the silky chickens. They are gorgeous for any of the farmhouse type decor. And look at the eggs, they're beautiful, different sort of colored eggs, and uh, some are larger than others. Now, some of you like to get ahead of the game. I tell you, you will be very, very ahead of Easter if you order these now. So don't be, um, don't be thinking, oh yeah, no, you're just gonna be organized, you know? You're just gonna be very organized for Easter if you've got these now ready for next year. I've just got a board here, painted it white, and I wanted to use these silky chicken transfers. So let's have a quick look at those. I've got a birdhouse. Now guys, I am so sorry to tell you, but there's only three of these left and it does come with two parts, okay? There's only three left. I know a bit of FOMO if you've missed out on this one and you were wanting it, but uh, that's the deal. And I thought I could create a little bit of a chicken house with the chickens inside it. So it is actually called birdhouse. I do have the link on my page or on Essential Stencil will find it for you. Now I'm not sure about these flower designs because I want my little chicks to sit inside the house. I'm not going to be using this additional part which is the window and the, um, the little doorway which sits in here. You could though and that would be cute too. That's a great a fun little addition. Um, but I do want to use some of these florals and I know they go off the edge and that's totally okay. So I'm going to use just a bit of a brown background. I think that will look cute with some of the white chickies. So, let's see, I'll use another brush. I want to use a bit of a larger one because we've got so much area here to fill. And let's go with this Woodwick color again. We could do green also, green might be nice. There's a great big area here to fill. In this case, I'm going to do, oops, I should probably offload right here because I'm feeling like there's going to be some rough edges on this birdhouse. So we're just making the background here. I am going to just put those leaves on and make them go off the board. I do like it sometimes when these fun designs go just off the board a little bit. I just love these little eggs nest and like I said before you know they'd be great for Easter you can be right ahead of the game for next Easter okay I'm sort of pouncing in a little bit of a rush just to try and get this project finished See, I'm just offloading my brush over here, pouncing it around down here. Now I've got a bit of a blotchy background, but hey, I don't know if that matters so much on our farmhouse chicken set. I was also looking for like fresh eggs or something like that stencil that we could put on the top of it, which may work too, but I think that they were sold out of the minis that I was looking at, so let's see if they come back in stock sometime. There we go, look at that. Oh, I like it. I like it just like that. Now let me just show you what this would look like if you put the window and the door. So remember it's a two-piece set. There was only three left, so I don't know if anyone's grabbed this set already. You can also sit that there. Then you could sit a little bird peeping out of the side of it. Um, from You know, one of those cardinals. Imagine this in a red and white for Christmas with a little cardinal peeping out the window. Some great ideas there. So yes. Okay, so we're gonna put some little chickens in here. I like the 
little outline, you know, of those flowers on the inside there, how they just are um, those outlines. And don't you love the way that you can just kind of make your stencils go off the page and it, off the page, off the wood, <laughs> off the sign, <laughs> and it doesn't really matter. I like it. It just sort of looks like it continues on. Okay, now here's my dilemma. Guys, I need to know which little chickens to put in the house. This one might have looked a little bit too big. And because it's a dark background, we sort of want a lighter colored chicken. We could do these three, might, mm, they are a bit big also. So we may need to go with, oh look, what about the three little chicks? They're adorable too. Where could we put a nest up here? You could put like a perch and then have these little nests up in the background or something. I don't know, there's just so many different options. We could add these flowers down the bottom. Oh look, these three. What about, this is a whole scene right here. We'll see cut out some things let's have a look see how we go but yes that third house is lovely cut around that little green piece of grass there sometimes I cut out all of my all of my little designs on the transfers and I pop them into the a little Ziploc bag or something so I've got them all there so then you can kind of just test them out see what ones might fit where so that one would fit nicely and of course we've got the little flowers in the background and that's okay that they're being covered up um, you know we don't want to put the chickens up here because that would look a bit weird let's see I think it'll fit perfectly and then you could always add some little flowers down the bottom so we're going to add this remember here's how we did the transfer take off the white backing put it over here and I do have some grass and rocks down there so if you wanted to you could probably tape off those flowers if you didn't want them as a part of your uh, birdhouse if you're using this chicken idea okay we've got some funny little flowers coming out the side of that chicken which may not look as great if we had a, you know, we could have taped them off. So we're just rubbing all over the transfer. And then we're just going to lift up the plastic on top. And gradually moving it away from the transfer. And then you're left with that beautiful transfer wait for you to I can't wait to receive the new Christmas bundles that her, they will be arriving to my house next week so that we can show you those designs so I look forward to doing something from those on my next live Christian Christmas and coastal Christmas like I said earlier we live near not far from beaches it's only like half an hour to an hour drive some of the nicest beaches here in our state so I can't wait to get those I can't wait to use them and I always love some beautiful inspirational scripture verse stencils too so they'll be fun for Christmas okay nearly there Grabbed our little chicken off some of those farmhouses style signs that people are making look at that so there's our gorgeous little silky chicken sitting in their little hutch ready to lay some eggs we could add a little flower down the bottom we could add the eggs down to the bottom that would be cute too there's some smaller ones over here they do we want to make sure we've got the smaller chickens smaller eggs for the smaller chickens because we don't want to make them look like they've just laid gigantic eggs if they're a small chicken you know <laughs> let's try see what that looks like you can always just leave it out um, put some down here I feel like we do it'd be lovely with a farm fresh eggs or something up the top there I don't know 
I'm have, going to stand back and have a look at this one and have a think about it. Where would you put them? Would you put them down here? Would you just leave them out? I just think there's so many cute things. We could also, the other thing is these um, flowers. I think they're daisies. Put some of these, add some of these and the little green grass tufts. So you could pop some of these down the bottom here. Two down the bottom, eggs down here. So just play around with it. Maybe it's a bit too busy down the bottom. I may still use uh, a stencil for the top of that. <clears throat> this is the one I had thought about using, but I'm not, it, there's, this one's sold out at the moment, so you won't be able to find this set. It's got a rise and shine, country kitchen, farm fresh eggs. See, I was thinking that might fit, but it might fit on the side there. So I'll have a think about that, and maybe I'll use that later on. But that's all I have for you today, folks.